Hello gamers, it's the Man45, also known as Slumper2, um, well, I had a recording of this, but already got it planned out, then it turned out the fire was destroyed, and now I have to do it again. Okay, then besides that, don't. We're playing a game called Cube, it's like Portal, in a sense. If anyone's played Portal, it was, um, a game where you solve... I'm sorry. <coughs> it's a game where you solve puzzles by shooting portals, places here and there. Solving puzzles, watching out for robots, Glados killing you, kick the lion in, stuff like that. Pretty much. Um, this is a game about pretty much cubes. It's a game of blocks, as someone could say. I have played this before, and I already just said I kind of had a video problem once already. But yeah, I am going back into this again. Start a new game, yes, I don't want to see on this loading screen. I don't understand this is dawn in the middle. Oh look, it's my hand. It's my bloody... It's a hand. What am I doing? I'm blacking out again. So it looks like. Oh. Still a hand. Is that breathing? I can hear myself breathing. What it sounds like. It sounds like just a bunch of breathing going on. Of course, that probably is what it is, breathing. It is what it has to be. So, if anyone hasn't noticed, again, it's just literally a game of blocks. Not Minecraft, not Terraria, not things of blocks, whatever game that goes with blocks. Like. Up, up there! There's my freedom and noise. Uh. I can now understand what's that dots there, and I realize that's in my screen, so it looked like I'm across here, but no, it's just a dot. Ooh, lights. That really is distracting. Easily. Where are my freedoms? Oh, I can poke up there. Why does it look like there's a way out up there? There's a way out up there, isn't there? Anyway. But the question is, is light source, but I don't see how we can get light source there. When I first played this game, this freaking freak me out. Anyway, let's do puzzle number one is open. If you don't guys don't know what this game is, because I don't think many people really have seen this game before. It's a game of doing stuff like this. Like these red blocks move up and down. Down, down, up. No way, what was it? Up, 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 down, down, down. Left, right, left, right, A, B, economic hold for when. I've probably done this wrong and now I'm gonna get sued by people. Yeah, I can instantly get sued by people. So, anyway, this is just a game quite literally of moving blocks like such in a fashion that this does this. First few parts are easy, gets harder as it goes on. Don't judge the game by its cover. It is a fun game though. And yes, I am kind of speeded past this because I've done this once already. And no one's going to see that video because that video doesn't exist. But yeah, the video does not exist anymore. But it's a simple game if you know what you're doing. Like such. I'm excellent at parkour, like the master, like me, probably. It's like if I go. Oh, no. Yep. Just jinxed myself right there. Up, 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 up. And yeah, so basically, this game is a fun game. I'm probably on speaking in circles, so. Yeah, don't mind me. Up, up, up. And then music kicks in. This is quite good. Compared to whatever new stuff comes out these days, no one likes Miley Cyrus. If I get attacked by people who like Miley Cyrus, I'm going to be kind of upset. I'm gonna say right now, I'm gonna do a little rant. Miley Cyrus is good at one point in her life, and then she started twerking. Once she started twerking, she ruined everything. 
chances of everything. I'm gonna say right now that has been the worst thing she could possibly done. So honestly, I do not like Miley Cyrus, and I don't know why I'm still talking about it. And I'm gonna miss it. So. One point on life, she was okay. I'm still speaking in circles, but now she's just a mess. Just a big freaking mess. No way if she's gonna recover from that. I keep seeing the news stuff. Oh look, we already finished this puzzle. You keep seeing the news stuff of what's going on and I really don't care for celebrities. I sound bad. But leave celebrities alone. Their life's their life. How did I get on the topic of my own desires? I cannot actually remember now. Okay, this room, I have introduced the um, reset keys that reset things, and this screen block that you can't actually move. So, stuff like you gotta do this. I'm just whizzing by this guy. Even if I haven't played this game, I feel like I know what I'm doing. Just look at this. It's not tough, it's. Oh, it gets tougher as a goes, kind of style game. But honestly, I enjoy it. It's relaxing and not really frustrating if you think about it. It's good to bring challenge your brain at things. And I'm already messing this up again. God. Up. Oh. But anyway, um, if you do enjoy this video and my commentary, it's always nice to have a like, it's a better way. And I'm messing this up still yet again. Up and do that, and that goes up like this. Like such, this kind of up so I can get up here. And you come out here. This is literally just a game of clicking and pushing buttons. Something seems off. That was weird. The block doesn't. That block has a mind of its own. I guess that's how it works. Okay, this one is the one that introduced, I'm going to say it once, and you're going to be like, oh my god, how is this even in the game about blocks? It is the ball. Oh my god, how is this game, is this a game about blocks? Why is it no ball, you ask? Well, I honestly don't know, it's just a ball. I guess this balls don't like the cubes or something like that. And I, they started a war, and now there's... They in order to sign a peace treaty, they had to add a ball into a game. I'm already falling around all over the place. This game is on Steam if you do want to try it out. For your own, see if you can beat me. I don't even know how far I'm going to get before something messes up. Something's bound to mess up. Always, whenever you play a game, something's bound to go wrong. Uh. Look at us, we're whizzing by on challenge 3 already. How's this possible, you may ask? I don't even know. So, next room. I ain't gonna probably do know, you just told you guys I've played this before, but I already had a problem. I enjoy these kind of puzzle games, honestly. Puzzle games are fun. And they've been my... Have they been my childhood? No, Pajama Jace, Pajama Sam has been my childhood. I bet you half you guys don't even know what the hell Pajama Sam is. Pajama Sam and Putt Putt, those were getting games in my childhood. The reason for that is the fact that, um, those are the only games I ever actually had to play when I was a kid. Besides board games. What are board games you yes, ask? Those are games you play on boards. No, no, not before the time before people all had phones. There was a thing called board games, and in it, 
you had things to do like trouble or do not knock the person off try to get yourself home or not not getting knocked back not being sent back to home can't speak sorry sorry same thing except yeah um Oh, stuff like that. Yes, I'm being sarcastic if people think I'm... Um, like, oh, I already know what a board game is, stuff like that, man. Well, yeah. My childhood's been... Um, pajama Sam. And I don't know... Are you? I even enjoyed those games, although I, when I was a kid I had no idea what I was doing. And also, when I was a kid, a lot of stuff freaked me out, but it's a different story, so... Um... Yeah, I enjoyed it. Then again, I guess I'm a sucker for some point and click games. I will probably be playing some if this channel actually ends up doing good. I do like point and click games. I think I am a big sucker for story games. Games where you. or puzzle games, really. Let alone open world games and first person games. I really like those. Puzzles are a really good thing for me, I like it. You get stuck for an hour trying to solve a puzzle, uh, but then when you it's just it's just a feeling of um not get me wrong. Solving a puzzle always you have a feeling. You have to like, oh I should have done this instead of doing this, right? Because of that. They make you feel smart. Like, if I didn't know I had to do this, I would probably be stuck here for an hour. But no, no, I know how to do that, and I know how to push blocks back and forth. Obviously, one goes to the other, and voila! Bob's your uncle, friend is your aunt. And... Yeah. I'm just whizzing by this, god. I don't know how long this is going to take me to finish, because I've already got to this point. And yeah, you're probably saying, but you already played this game once already. Yeah, it's true, I played this game once already. But honestly, I didn't know what I was doing until that one. It's challenging, it's a fun game. It's just, you need to know what you're doing to do things, that's all it is. Puzzle games are like the... Puzzle games are the funnest stuff in, sometimes in the world. Because... It's just a sense of accomplishment when you actually end up doing awesome on a puzzle game. Well, that's the wrong way. Like, you sit there and you're on a puzzle game, right? And you sit there contemplating. You just sit there and you think, like, what do I do? Do I do this? Do I do this? Do I do this? Do I do this? Like, am I supposed to lift this out? Or am I supposed to push this in? The whole sense of puzzle games is really fun, so I like this. It's that feeling that when you finally understand how it all works. Like this. It took me a long time to actually understand. But if I do this, it shoots this into there, and that's how that works. It's You can see it come into play. So that's why it's nice before you actually tackle a puzzle, is to look what you got here. So this does this. And if I... I don't think I'm gonna reach that from you, so do this and Yeah, we obviously know that does this and this does this, right? Depending where you click the more blocks come out, the more blocks go in. But this moves up by itself. Stuff like that. I need to get like oh, what I need to do is this moves around and I'm pressing it on more sides, but that's okay. This moves around like such. We now know that that's, that's what it does. It's meant to do that. And like, this is meant to do this. And we're meant to do this, so we can get the ball here. It's the sense of trial or error that I like in a puzzle game that makes it fun. It's the sense of accomplishment when you do it and you suddenly the room goes green of uh, awesomeness that you are an awesome person. 
Like, I am an awesome person because I finally finished this puzzle I was stuck on for a year. It's just, it's fun. It challenges your brain, although this seems like I'm just whizzing by this like crazy. I wonder where this goes. It just goes down. Like, that's it. You know, I just walk over and like, is this glass? This isn't glass because the ball goes through it. No, it's mysteries. And there we go, we finished the third puzzle already. Then we have a few more puzzles left, and this they get harder. It's not like it gets easier. It gets harder. But yeah, other than that, what's in this room? And I already started the puzzle. I don't know, maybe this will remember me next time. Yeah. I have no idea what to do here. But anyway, I think that's a good place to start leaving off, although I kinda just started this room, I sure should have done that. But if you're new to this channel and I haven't done put much out or you've been a veteran and you've seen me a few times and have really realized I put stuff out for a while. I haven't actually put stuff out for a while, so yeah, but Here's my channel. Welcome to Superman 45. I do random games. I will do Minecraft. I just don't feel like much because it's been done so many times. A lot of YouTubers are on Minecraft right now. We are gonna get to Minecraft later. That's a different color. Is that a shadow? It's probably a shadow. I don't know. Anyway. But yeah. If I'm a bad commentator, please leave a comment in, in uh, comments. If I'm commentating is good or bad, I don't know how I sound, because I sound pretty good to me, but, yeah. Also, it'd be nice if you leave a... But also, subscribe to me if you want to see more of these videos, there will be a more. I will uh, I have a plan for other videos such as... probably other games, I'm not sure if other people have seen from other YouTubers or stuff like that, but... Yeah, this is a game I felt like playing, considering... It's the only one in my Steam library that's uploaded right now. Yeah. <sighs> that's what happens when you don't have internet for a long time, and then you finally get it back. So, if you need IO to my channel, I am not dead, I am alive. I just haven't put something out in a very long time. And if you're new to my channel, welcome to... Welcome to Superman 45. I also, as this part of the Half Force, we are going to be a gaming channel. We just kind of, sort of, haven't done anything yet. But yeah. Other than that, thank you for watching. This is Superman 45. It'd be nice also if you leave a like. A like's very appreciated. It means that, yeah, no, obviously it's a good thing. Um, music just stopped. Uh, oh, sorry, anyway. Thank you for watching. This has been Superman45. Signing off. Peace off.